good afternoon good morning good evening my fellow creative designers and content creators welcome once again to another exciting episode on this channel and in today's episode this is what you are going to design this beautiful um, music cover art yes it's a music cover art i created for just a sample that i created and i feel like um by popular request i need to share the tutorials and step by step how i was able to achieve this awesome a music cover arts um, design in photoshop so please if this seems to be interesting to you kindly stick around and then let's walk through the tutorials step by step from start to the end so without wasting my time control n to open a new document and i choose a square size yes a square which is 2000 by 2000 the width is 2000 height 2000 resolution 300 and then it's for social media handles so just write the name music cover art the music cover art design all right so this is okay and then i'll click on create then to have a nice background like this so the first thing i'm going to do is to work with the background and remember all the resources file will be shared under the description for you to um, download and then practice so without wasting much time just let me go and copy the backgrounds yes let me go and copy the background so i have this this and that so i'll drag all i'll drag all of them i'll push them here and then don't worry i'll share it with you i'll push them here and then control t to reduce the size just con uh, control z to zoom it down like this and then push it to this side and then i bring it to this side awesome 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 this is great this is great this is great this is exactly what we did this is exactly what we did and then press enter Control plus sign to zoom it in. Yeah. All right. So then we have zoomed it in nicely like this. I'll just position it this way. And this is it. And the first one, let me hide them for you to see. So the first one was this nice background we brought. I'll share it with you. And then we brought this and um, praying thing like this. And then we cleared some parts. And then we put the blending mode to vivid light. And then after that, we brought this um, musical instrument. And then we clear some part and then put the blending option to also screen and then we are able to get something nice like this so after that we put everything in a group control j and then call it the background yes the background all right so the background is set nicely the background is set nicely then we went ahead to go and work on more yes that is the shapes so we picked a rectangle and then we drew a nice shape so let's go and do it over here so we pick a rectangle and then give it color white yes give it color white and then you draw it nicely like this and then you give it color white let's pick the color from this side so color white and that's awesome that's awesome you come back to the move to control t and then right click it and then distort it to this you know right click it and then you warp it like this good so after wrapping you hold here and then push it to this side or better so you can push here up and then you push here in something like this and that is how we're able to get that shape over there so you push it this way and that is perfect so click on enter and then accept the changes yes now we brought it down we brought it down brought it down and then you go and copy the test on it the test on it which this is it and this is the rectangle and then the beneath one so we have our microphone nicely like this so i'll, I'll give you all the, the details i'll give you all the details and for you to just put it over there so i'll drag everything this way and then push it down this way good awesome 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 so meaning this shape must come up the shape must come up the shape must come up nicely 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 and then all these details you select them once again Control t and then you can even scale it up yes can scale it up and bring it down a bit yeah bring it down a bit and that is it for the meantime so unless i think we have to add more of the details to it we have to group all of them in one side yeah group all of them in one side and then the produce by just drag this produce by and then put it over there drag the produce by and then drop it over here 
and then the font I use is SQL Sense, SQL Sense, and then I gave it this color FF6000, FF6000. That is the hex code for the police by. So I need to set the guide view guide and then new guide layout and we set it to maybe let's set it to four and then four as well then you can have the exact middle let's see the produce by good it's at the center it's at the center and push it up a bit push it up a bit so the produce by then the name which is a star smith yeah that is the name we use for the uh, for the purpose of this tutorial so you can even change it if you wish you can change it if you wish to change it let me drag it again all right so now the name is also set nicely control t to check if it's at the center then this is at the center nicely 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 and then i think this and then this must calm down a bit yes they must calm down a bit they must calm down especially if we put the this you have to calm down a bit yeah to get enough space up there to put a lot of details so produce by two must go up a bit and then the name esther smith must go up a bit and then the next detail is which one and that's all i think that's all and maybe this details and then the bit details that is the name and then the logo and these things and then it's available on all social media platform these details too might come so let's see and um, we we'll pick this pick this pick this pick this and then fix this and then i think this name must go off okay so let's see is this one rather good so pick this pick this pick this and then come and pick this all right so you drag all of it drag all of it and then release it here nicely like this and that is awesome that is awesome that is awesome all right so let's see if it's at the center and it's not at the center exactly so you position it at the center and then push it up meaning this rectangle must go up a bit sorry i said rectangle that shape must go up a bit to be able to have enough space down there yeah to be able to have enough space down there and all this side meaning must go up again yes must go up again okay 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 and i think this to must go up and i think this name esther smith at the top we need to increase the size and i think it's okay and do we have some images do we have some images let's close this thing Control j and then call it text yes okay so this is made up of all the text yes we have put all the text and then it's not only text text and shape all right, so that is the test and shape. And if you have any image you need to add, let me go and quickly check on my um, resources file. Okay, but in the previous tutorial, we didn't put any image. So we are mistaking this image to be, let's see if we are taking this image as Esther Smith, then let's see how best we can handle this image. So add the layer max, be on the keyboard, and then deactivate the caps lock, and then let's blur this side or let's clear this side and then let's see let's see let's see this is getting better this is getting better this is getting better this is getting better 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 and guys what do you think ah, ah, ah. we have made a new design we have made a new design we have made a new design and then you can put this one is also in a group and then call it image okay so that is it and then when we are done we didn't finish we need to boost the whole design up so alt Control, shift and then e to match everything together right click it and then go to convert to smart objects all right now it's done uh, converted to smart object come to filter and then go to camera or filter and then let's boost the whole flyer up let's boost it up 
let's boost everything up nicely like this and guys that is it please subscribe to this channel like share comment and let me know how this channel is helping you in any other ways in so doing you are helping this channel to grow and then comment as well comment as well just any two or three words this that will make the channel grow Kindly do so for us and then let's boost it up push this here to this side and i think is it too much so this is okay and then let's see the tint if it's not okay okay we'll return it back and i think let's come to contrast so we we'll boost contrast to this side highlight what about you i think this highlight is okay so let me go and see black and i think this is okay texture and texture this is awesome and then let's see clarity let's see clarity i think this is okay clarity is plus 11 let's see the hairs or let's come to vibrance and let's see and vibrance this is okay this is okay and then let's see saturation you can even push the saturation to you can boost it up this way and you can you can you can just play with this one let's go to details and see you go to details and then let's see here push this side to this way and then let's add some noise inside yeah and then you can see color noise reduction and guys just experiment with everything you have experiment with everything you have and if it's okay let's come back to effect again and let's see greens so let's boost this up and then and uh, i think this is awesome or what do you think and if it's okay let's see before and after guys you realize that this is the before and this is after the after looks great the after looks great then if it's okay for us we click on okay then the effect to be applied to the whole flyer boom now you see good again this is the before and this is the after and it looks great it looks great it looks great it looks great and then after that just this is all this is all this is all this is all this all so this is how we're able to achieve this awesome and um, music album cover in photoshop please download the resources for our practice and let me know how it feels in the comment section below i love you and i'll see you in the next tutorials bye for now